Hi friends, it's me, Pops. Let's learn and read today. Let's go outside and meet up with Twinkle. Hi Twinkle, I brought our friends along with me. Can you say hi friends? Twinkle loves that. I have a question for you at home. Have you ever told a story before? Or has anyone ever told you a story? Tell us some of your favorite books or stories. Oh, that's a good one. I love all of those stories, friends. Stories can be full of wonder, adventure, excitement, or magic. Stories have been around for thousands of years, and they used to be done through cave paintings. But today, most stories are told through someone talking, books, plays, movies, or even music. They have a beginning, a middle, and an end. Would you like me to tell you a story at home? Let's make this story magical. Once upon a time, there was a little girl named Samantha and she had a special secret. Samantha had a piece of chalk. Now this piece of chalk is no ordinary piece of chalk. It's magical. You're probably thinking, how can a simple piece of chalk be magical? Well, whenever Samantha would draw a picture on her front sidewalk, that picture would come to life. She came across the piece of chalk one day while walking home from school when out of the corner of her eye, she saw a bright white piece of chalk. She reached down to pick it up, and as her fingers wrapped around it, it began to change color. But not just any color, the color she was thinking about in her head. She looked up at the bright blue sky, and the chalk turned blue. She looked down at the green grass, and the chalk turned green. Samantha was in such amazement, she ran as fast as she could all the way home. Samantha discovered, when she started to draw the chalk on her sidewalk, that not only did the colors change, but the pictures began to move. So when she drew a kitty cat, the cat began to walk around on the sidewalk, curling up next to her toes. And when she drew a race car, the car vroomed to life, racing down the pavement, turning left, and right and winding through her legs towards the finish line. She would draw everything her imagination could think of. From unicorns dancing on top of rainbows to dragons swooping through the clouds, ready to battle a handsome prince. But her best creation of all was a little girl named Chalk Girl. Samantha drew her with a bright pink dress and purple hair that twisted down all the way to her toes. She loved to draw Chalk Girl doing all sorts of activities. But one day, it started to rain, and Samantha watched from her house as all of her magical chalk drawings got washed away. Samantha was very sad. All of her hard work was gone, along with her friend Chalk Girl. The next day, after it stopped raining, Samantha went back outside to find the blank sidewalk with no magical chalk drawings. But as she stood there, Samantha thought to herself saying, Hey, all of my chalk drawings came from my imagination. With a little hard work, all I have to do is draw them again. So off she went, redrawing all of her magical creations, including her friend Chalk Girl. Only this time, she drew it all under an umbrella. The end. Did you like my story? You can create your own story at home. All you need is your imagination to think of something up. And sometimes the best stories come from your heart. Thanks for stopping by my treehouse today. Twinkle and I had a blast telling stories with you and learning all about your favorite stories. Parents, make sure to subscribe for more fun videos coming out really soon. Later, Gators!